So now let's talk about some parameters in the white water solver. First thing that Houdini do, does by uh, by default is that it refers to this volumes out null. This volumes out null here is um, is just this merge flip tank which merges our compressed cache. And this compressed cache have uh, they had the uh, two fields that the uh, DOB network needs for the simulation, which is the surface field and the velocity field. Okay. So here is the first thing that Houdini does by default and if you create this from scratch you should refer to the uh, volume source and the emission source. The emission source is just the white water source which I assume you have um, you have exported that on your disk because you don't uh, you don't need to calculate this every time you simulate your white water simulation okay. Uh, the white water scale this should be uh, linked to the particle separation of uh, of our simulation and they should be the same value surely when you just decrease the white water scale there will be more particles or there will be um, more white water the voxel size is the resolution of the uh, volumetric simulation um, and I will use the value of 0.05 okay uh, in the emission tab I have added this velocity offset of 0.02 and this will ensure that uh, the foam covers the simulation or will be offset by a distance of 0.02 over my simulation and uh, this will will assure uh, that the foam covers the mesh when when we just render the simulation okay and uh, for the lifespan this is the uh, the span over the this is the age of the particles in seconds we will use 4.5 okay and uh, in this advanced tab here we have aging rates uh, which is the uh, the age of uh, the components of the white water we have three components of white water bubbles and foam uh, and we also have spray so uh, we will just uh, make the bubbles live, uh, uh, live larger than the foam it will be something like 25 and we will make the foam 1.5 and um, now we, we use uh, the sign number for the bubbles because bubbles um, converts to is converted to foam when they just reach the surface of water so when we just uh, make more bubbles there will be uh, more chance for the particles to be converted into foam and um, this will make uh, will make our simulation accurate and uh, this will increase the uh, the white water okay uh, we can add a noise on the velocity but I won't add this now and the limits here uh, we are limiting the simulation uh, within the boundaries of uh, of our simulation that is used in the DOP network so now it's linked this parameter is linked to the auto DOP network limit boundaries and the center and surely this closed boundaries as well where are you going to use this collision swap and uh, for this collision swap here we need we need to do something here in this navy plane uh, I think it's better to cache those two things here on desk in uh, because you don't uh, you don't want to waste your time just uh, just calculating the VDB every time you simulate a test for your white water. So uh, we're just going to merge the collision and the VDB here to this merge node. We are going to make a null. And it is null node. We will call it out merged collision. Okay. And then the white water simulation in this collision swap. We are going to point to the out merged collision. The surface 
or the SDF name will be surface also we are going to add the state attribute and here in the forces we will do tests for these uh, parameters in the next video okay thank you for watching one thing that you may you should make sure you have turned it off in the advanced tab is use OpenCL because if you don't have a um, uh, very uh, good GPU this will cause your program to crash so this is enabled by default I, I am using my CPU to, to calculate the simulation don't use uh, OpenCL if you don't have a strong uh, GPU so uh, this is very important and I don't know why this is enabled uh, by default but it made my program crash um, whenever uh, it makes my program crash whenever I uh, simulate white water okay so I'd like you to uh, to notice this so thank you